I've made it to my next destination. This dresser box is so pretty. It's like so Art Deco. 45 seems a little pricey though. Little tea bag holders. Three for 12, that's a good price for a collector. Uh, I just had four of these and I sold them as a set for, I think, 21. So much depression glass. Everyone keeps talking about how depression glass is making a comeback. I don't know if that's true because I don't follow it because, quite frankly, it's not my thing. Ooh, cat face, cat face. Uh, expensive cat face. Man, yeah, 35? Whoa. I already know I'm about to get got by this. Uh, I've seen these before. Yep, glass. Every time I, th I think they're loose sight, uh, I need to stop picking those up. English candy tin. I'm sure this is... Yeah, that's retail. I love all these old advertising thermometers. This is the only one that sticks out to me, though. And it's definitely priced at retail. Good grief. That is a lot of milk bottles and a lot of jars. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this bank. Uh, 38 though, that seems relatively high. Uh, it's kind of wedged in here, so I'm not going to pick it up. It's really pretty though. Something tells me this is going to be a fake out retirement sale. What is that? What? 200? Yeah. Definitely a fake out retirement sale. Um, I'm not sure what the point in running 60% off is when everything seems to be marked up hundreds of percents. Uh, yeah, that's like, so expensive. Crazy. <laughs> I really hope this is what I think it is. Oh my gosh, it is. Uh, I love these fake pottery nuts in here. It's only $12. If it was for myself, I'd totally buy it. Stop. How cute is this? Little costume with the pin. Wow, that is really adorable. Oh my gosh, I want this so bad. <laughs> 28 That's right on the nose. Uh, these usually sell between like 25 and 35 It is absolutely adorable. Oh, it's really hard to walk away from. I wish I had a purpose for it for myself. Hmm. This guy's kind of hard to find. 18. Yeah, he's definitely got too much paint loss for me for that. It's close enough as it is. I love Bohemian Glass. It's pink. You know, that's actually not a bad price at all for a collector. <laughs> it's Betty Poop. <laughs> Wow, this is really funny. I've never seen this before. It's weirdly heavy. Huh. She doesn't look like she has that much age, though. Ooh. Interesting. Is it a lipstick holder? It's a Nesco. $12? That seems like a steal. Um, I've never seen this one before. I th think I'm actually going to look it up. So I only found one, and it sold for 25 So I think I could double my money, but honestly, it's just not my favorite design. I think I'm going to hold out. And this is pretty cute. Owls usually sell pretty well, but sometimes I have trouble with this uh, luster wear. The price is right, though. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this. <gasps> oh my gosh, and it's only like $9. This is so great. Wow, and it's a wall pocket. That's awesome. <laughs> I'm definitely going to take this, obviously. I'm really excited about it. It's in pretty good condition. It's got a tiny bit of wear around the edges, but it doesn't bother me. Oh, this is so pretty. I love these Art Nuevo portraits, but 19 is a little too close to retail for me. Oh my gosh, I'm not sure which is more horrifying, the doll or the price tag on it. Gosh, this cat planner is so cute. And it's a really good seller, too, with the bonnet. But $30 is what I'd charge for it, too. Dang. How did I not see this hanging here? This is amazing. 
I love anything heart-shaped, and I bet it would be so incredible lit up. 300 bucks. I can't even be mad at it. I've never seen one like that before. <laughs> but I'm honestly having a really hard time walking away. I'm considering making an offer, but for 300 I feel like it needs a little extra something. <laughs> oh, I like him. 65 but he's got a hole in his head wow the toy situation happening here is epic uh see the rubber face the qp oh my gosh do you think this actually does anything because i really want to replace it <laughs> with my vacuum or broom whatever any excuse to use this i feel like this is made for me <laughs> I was wondering why Mr. Magoo was only $10, and then I picked it up and realized he's harboring a dark secret. The top of his hat is disgusting, <laughs> so I'm gonna walk away from it. Oh, this is one of my favorite sets, uh, $10. It's got a little bit of paint loss. The first couple times I had it, it did pretty well. I wanna say it sold for 27, but I feel like I've been seeing them uh, for less and less and with the paint loss and that little chip I can't justify it sadly I like the sailors they're only eight dollars but I actually think they're new oh my gosh whole Howard this is amazing I would recognize this face anywhere and they're only fifteen dollars which is completely insane these are easily $65, $70 set. Um, wow, I feel like they must be repaired. There's gotta be something wrong with them. I don't know, but I'm taking these. Oh my gosh, duh. They're two salt shakers. I just don't know how I didn't see that in the first place. Um, normally, the other one would be facing the other direction and have three holes. But either way, I mean, $15, I'm not going to complain about it too much. This outfit is adorable. It's in really good condition, too. Uh, it definitely seems like the front's a little bit uncomfortable, but I wish I could fit into that top. And this set of banana shakers, these are so retro. Uh, but $15 is pretty much retail. I pick up these bears from time to time if the price is right. Uh, but this one's 20 which is what I'd get for it after fees. Wow, this person's case is amazing. And talk about amazing, it's the Madame Alexander Dion quintuplets with their original tags and their original box. This is incredible. They're not their original composition ones, but they're in pristine, like new condition. They're priced at $350. They probably sell for $325 to $425, so I'm going to have to leave them alone. Also, that clown rattle is awesome. I'm trying to make out the price on that uh, stuffed rabbit in the gingham jumpsuit. It's pretty fun. But I have a lot of stuffed rabbits right now, and there's just so much to look at. Gosh, I can't get over those dolls. And that cupie with the weird hair. Uh, it's definitely real hair. Also, love the bud base. $12.50 is a great price. Wow, it's a lot. And this huge wall of grab bag miniatures. This is pretty much my dream. But the Goldilocks and the three bears is definitely the cutest. Uh, unfortunately, they're 10 and I'd probably get that after fees. And this is so, so tempting. Uh, after fees, I'd probably only make like seven bucks, maybe. But I love it so much. I'm also kind of nervous that I'd somehow justify just keeping it and putting it in my kitchen. And I don't really need that. They have so many great lamb planters. This one definitely sticks out though. Let's see, 24. Yeah, they're all right about retail. Don't worry, I see the cats, but there's something a little off about them. Uh, Felix, yeah, he's uh, too new for me. Not what I thought. I'm trying to get over to this cutie here. Yeah, 
38, even with 20%, it's definitely too close, especially because of his condition. I probably say this every day, but I love slack glass. 13. Hmm. That's it doesn't leave as much room as I'd like. I think I'm gonna pass today. These are kind of neat, but they look new. Oh, they're dated 86. That's interesting. I would have thought they were newer. Um, they're only $4 each, but I know I love strawberries. I think I'm gonna pass today. Wow, this is undeniably a great price. It's only $6.75 for the mug. Um, it's definitely a no-brainer, but I'm gonna go against the green. How much is this picture? Yeah. Since there's an abundance of them, I think I'm actually gonna pass, even though it's a little weird. Ooh, and the Norcrest Mailman Salt and Pepper Shakers, they're only $14.50. I feel like they're an easy $25, $27. Um, they're in good condition, but to be honest, I'm not even halfway through this place, so I think I'm just gonna keep going. And I love the color of the handkerchief face, but that's pretty much right on the money. Ooh, this pot holder's fun. Oh, it's a pair. $12. Yeah, that's probably what I'd charge for the pair, too. Bean bag ashtray. But I'm only really interested in the ones that have the stuffed animals attached to them. Though $8 is a pretty good price for that. Uh-oh. <laughs>